close to the end of the Magnificent Mile is Water Tower Place, where I'm headed today. And behind it, the John Hammond Museum. At Food Life at Water Tower Place, one of the best things that I like to get is the chicken gumbo and a pepperoni pizza slice. So this is the main thing that I'm here in Chicago for is to see Disenchanted. It's a take on the Disney princesses that should be a little bit more raunchy than you would normally expect from Disney. So it'll be interesting to see how raunchy it actually gets. As I'm waiting, here's another nice view of the John Hancock Center. Hey there! Hey. You did a fantastic job. Thank you very much. Here I am with oh, Snow video. White. We're videoing Hi. for YouTube here. <laughs> so, Thank you, dude. Yeah. Well, Thank you. you were awesome. All oh, by yeah. yourself. Yeah, that's that the first was, time that's happened. That was well great, done. man. All right. Thank you. Uh, thanks, this guy. thanks for making the show special. It was really something cool. Oh, thanks. So, I'm so yeah. glad you liked it. Thank yeah. you for coming. It was lots is this of fun. a video? This is a video. Oh my gosh, what are you going to do with it? I shoot some stuff on YouTube. And so, you know. Oh, awesome. Yes. All right. This is so, so disenchanted cool. is very disenchanted. good. People have to go see it. Go see it. Come yes. see it. Find it in your town. We're only here to the fans to so come. Yes. Come. Oh, Everybody oh, agrees. He He's the best audience member because he actually yelled and nobody ever actually yelled, but he did. Oh, thank you. <laughs> So one of the best things about Disenchanted was the lead role of Snow White, played by Merritt Cruz in this production. And she did such a great job of corralling all the characters that there was some zaniness to be had, there was some adult humor, but ultimately it always seemed like she kept things on track to uh, keep things a little bit on the softer side and uh, trying to make sure that everybody had their chance to shine. One of the big things that was going through my mind when I was thinking about the play later on was that it really is quite similar to the vibe of The Muppet Show, where to think of Snow White as like Kermit the Frog, just kind of trying to get all the acts together and hoping that it would turn out in the end, which ultimately it did. Uh, it's a very fun show. I hope it has a good success in its tour, and I do hope that it comes back when my daughters are old enough to see it. Disenchanted, one of Rick's picks.